In this particular video of the playlist, I will show you how to enable data layer on our website. First, let's know what data layer is. Data layer is a JavaScript object that is used to pass information from your website to your Tag Manager container. If you want to track events of your website, then you must have to enable this data layer on your website. If we don't do that, then we will get a few informations of our website on the Google Tag Manager. Let's see. This is my website. I haven't enabled data layer on this website. And this is my Google Tag Manager. If I go to preview mode. Okay, Tag Assistant connected. Now let's go to Tag Assistant tab and click on continue. Now if I go to data layer, then you can see here there hasn't been passed any information from our website to the Google Tag Manager. Now we will enable data layer on the website and after that we will get so many information here. So let's see how to do that. In my case, this is a WordPress website. So there is a very useful plugin that I have shown in the previous video. With the help of that plugin, we will enable data layer here very easily. So I'm going to log into this website. Now let's go to settings and from there Google Tag Manager. Then go to integration and from there WooCommerce. Here are so many options but what we need is to track enhanced e-commerce. Check this option if you would like to track in e-commerce data. So we are going to check this and then save these changes. Now we should go back to Google Tag Manager and preview again. So go to Google Tag Manager and click on preview. Tag Assistant connected. Go to Tag Assistant tab and click on continue. Now if I select here an event like view item list and then go to data layer. You can see here so many information is being passed from our website to Google Tag Manager. Now we can track e-commerce data from here. This is in the case of WordPress website. If your website on Shopify or Laravel or its custom made website, then how to enable data layer on those websites. Soon I will make a video on this topic. So that's it in this video. If you have any question or doubt, don't hesitate to drop down in the comment box. I will reply that as much as possible. And if you need any service, then I am a professional freelancer working on Fiverr and also working on Upwork. You can place an order on these marketplaces, otherwise you can contact me on this WhatsApp number or on this Gmail address. If you found this video useful, hit the thumbs up button below the video and consider subscribing to my channel. So see you in another video, until then goodbye, thank you so much.